Now, India has reported a record 200,000 new COVID-19 cases on Thursday, as many hospitals treating coronavirus patients reported severe shortages of beds and oxygen supplies. The surge was the seventh record daily increase in the last eight days and comes as India battles a massive second wave of infections in its epicenter, Mumbai. The Western state accounts for about a quarter of the country's total cases. Two patients to one bed, gasping for air and wearing oxygen masks. This is the reality inside a government hospital in India's capital, New Delhi, battling the country's growing COVID-19 crisis. Daily infections in India crossed 200,000 on Thursday, according to official data, making it the highest anywhere in the world. At Lok Nayak J. Prakash Narayan Hospital, one of India's largest COVID-only facilities with more than 1,500 beds, a stream of ambulances ferried patients to the overflowing casualty ward. Dr. Suresh Kumar is the hospital's medical director. We are definitely overburdened. We are already working at the full capacity, rather double of the capacity. Our initial ICU beds were less. But now we have increased the, just double the number of ICU beds. Initially it was only 54 ICU beds, now we have 300 plus ICU beds. After imposing one of the world's strictest lockdowns for nearly three months last year, India's government relaxed almost all curbs by the beginning of 2021. Now, many regions, including Mumbai and the rest of Maharashtra state, are introducing localized restrictions. The government has blamed a widespread failure to practice social distancing and wear face masks. Experts have blamed everything from official complacency to aggressive variants. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.